Oh, welcome back to the channel, everybody. I know I haven't been making a lot of videos, but this is the type of stuff I'm doing. You know, I got these holes down here where I dug out rocks. These were small rocks here. Um, had some big ones down there. A lot of those holes have already been filled. I got a bunch of fill that I moved down there. I got some up there. Of course, I got a little here. Let's walk down. Running a little 234 because it's got a small bucket and it's easier to place it where you want it. But we'll show you here the mass. We mow this, we just like it mowed. We're, we're grass people, as you probably have figured. Uh, try to keep the place looking fairly good. Just built a little bit of topsoil there. But we got to put a little half a bucket in there. That one's pretty well sat. This here needs to be tuned up. That was two big holes. Two big rocks you can see where that low spot is there was a big one right here and a big one up here there was a real big one over there there was a pretty good size one right here i haven't packed this in yet so i'm gonna have some extra here which will probably go up in that area and then this pile here is gonna go down there i dug out i think there was three rocks down there i dug out and there's one here that i should have dug out that i didn't that one is hides a rock but i may just kind of feather some stuff over it and all these divots is where i've dug out rocks i mean that's probably six inches deep you pound like hell going over it with a lawnmower so i'm gonna dump some in there it's pretty hard work to make an interesting video out of something like this but i'll film a little bit of it and uh, just show you kind of what i'm doing i've got those shingles up to the tape seam. Um, two coats, front and back on the shingles, and then I put them up afterwards. So I got that up far enough that I'm happy with it for now. Put these rocks like this on top, the lawnmower will pick up. But I'll put her over there in the woods. So, little divot there, could use a little bit. Dug a rock out there. So anyway, yeah, let's see what we can do here. Got the umbrella on, it's 79 degrees and fairly warm. Just to keep a little sun off my back, so.
Well, we're still recording, that's a good thing. So anyway, I don't get it too smooth like you would on the lawn, but that'll be good enough time we run over it. I'll uh, put the blade down flat and go over it one more time. I guess that's a rock. Yeah, it is. But, uh, so anyway, gotta do the same thing there. And I dumped a little extra over there in that low spot. I'll go smooth that out. This is the type of stuff I'm up to, everybody. Nothing much exciting. Um, this here, oh, well, you can see the difference in grass right there. That's as far as we'd mowed last year. Then we went down about where the tractor is this year, or early this spring. And in the last month or so, I've got all the rocks picked in there. The only place I got a mess is where that bunch of little alders is. And we'll clean that mess up. And eventually, I want to get that all so I can mow it. It's just a mess right now. Um, as you know, well, some of you may know, I had my pilot's license a long time ago and I was always going to build me an airplane and fly it off of here. And as I got older, I came up with this thing called Vertigo and I don't dare to fly anymore. So that's a dream never realized. That's all right, we have a lot of those in life. Just a minor setback is what I'm gonna call it. Um, move on to the next project. So, you know, it's just lawn now. And, uh, anyway, me and Carol are doing great. This is actually the Sunday of Labor Day weekend. And she's up there selling corn, running the stand, and I'm down here trying to get stuff so we can mow it a little easier. So, anyway. That's all I'm going to do on this video, guys. Take care, and we'll see you on the next one.